Our next speaker retired as superintendent of the Newcastle County Votech School District in 2011 after 28 years with the district and 40 years in, as an educator in Delaware. He's been a principal, assistant principal, supervisor at the state level, and a special education teacher. Steve Godowski was also responsible for bringing together the superintendents of Newcastle County. Ray mentioned his name and that, and he really was the critical person in bringing these superintendents together to unify the districts. He has just been approved as of this past Wednesday to serve as the Secretary of Education of Delaware. So it's my great honor to welcome Steve Godowski. Thank you very much. Uh, it's a privilege for me to be here um, this morning, and I will say I was invited uh, by Jim, thank you, and I was either going to come here as the Secretary of Education or a fully retired uh, administrator. And thankfully, uh, I was confirmed on Wednesday, um, potential contentious hearing. It turned out great. And uh, I'm in the book as Secretary of Ed Edge. Thank you, of Education. Thank you for the confidence. Um, welcome, everyone. This is full circle for us in Delaware and me personally. I remember in 20, uh, 2005, coming to this event in the, in the fall and uh, the spring and l hearing about the Institute and their goals. And I thought, and we listened to Philadelphia Institute talk about their model, and we thought that someday, wouldn't it be fantastic for us to replicate that model in Delaware? And lo and behold, we're on the stage today that we've, we have come full circle and we've got a thriving uh, Delaware Institute that's growing every day. So it's a lot of, we're very proud of those accomplishments. But I will say this, it took us a six year journey to go from start to uh, institute. And Jim Vivian with Ray Thylacker said, and, and you led the way, you had the vision, we didn't have to go fast, take our time, get it right. That was more important than a quick implementation. You don't hear that every day. Again, we, we appreciate that so much, and it resulted in a strong program. Uh, and so I guess in 2010, we were formally named as the new member of the League of Teacher Institutes. It was a complicated process. Ray mentioned five school districts, working with the, a new university, University of Delaware, uh, getting support, funding, et cetera, but it all worked out. And I will say this, one thing, the driving force behind all this was our, the strength of our participating teachers. They drove the effort, and that's what's so unique about the Yale National Inici Initiative, that teachers have the strongest voice. It is very impressive. So as a superintendent, when we looked at this, Ray mentioned two teachers. The truth is, Carrie Riches was the teacher to come to Yale the first time. She did not want to travel by herself. Ray, that's why you came. <laughs> Ray was a veteran. He had retired from Pennsylvania School District, and uh, he wasn't our first choice. <laughs> but he came and he fell in love with the process. And it's really a tribute to everything that we do in, in this r regard. When they came back and then subsequently we had other teachers come back. And again, it was, we didn't take our teachers of the year every time. We took a mixed group, high interest, low interest, just curious. And every teacher came back inspired. It was, for me, it was an unbelievable experience to feel that, to see that, to hear their interest. Um, Teacher-led, teacher-inspired, uh, it strengthened our school and the idea of strengthening public schools everywhere, especially in high-need schools. And so for me and others, it was an easy talk with other superintendents when I said this professional learning, this professional development works. It is completely inspiring. And those teachers um, took different roles in our district, in the state, everywhere, and it was, it was a win-win. So I pushed it, our superintendents and, and others pushed it, and here we are today. It's stronger than ever. I want to also say, uh, now that I'm at the Department of Education, in our equity plan, we talked about the National Teacher in Institute because it serves teachers with emphasis in high-need schools. 
and we were one of the first school uh, states approved with equity plan. We're proud of that accomplishment. Um, I want to uh, end by saying again that um, we're thrilled to be here full circle. We're committed to the effort, and it's amazing how a small number of teachers can accomplish great things. And of course, those numbers have gotten larger and larger. But we started with two teachers in Delaware, and look where we are today. Thank you so much. Have a great conference.